Welcome to Alternative Career Pathways, where we explore some careers that are critical to the development of St. Kitts and Nevis, but in which we have a shortage of expertise. Thinking about getting a degree? Why not consider one in Forensic Science? Forensic Science is the application of analytical science techniques to a legal proceedings. Typically, a forensic scientist would be submitted an item on which they would perform some testing using analytical instrumentation. From that testing, they would formulate a scientific report to submit to the court, as well as their expert testimony, delivering their professional opinion on the results of the testing. When you get rapid development and advancement of a country, crime becomes more of a concern for the general population. So we need good forensic scientists, good forensic expertise right here locally so we can solve crimes and give closure to victims so that as the country continues to develop, we can give people closure that their investments will be safe and secure. So in terms of scientific expertise, what we also need is going to be infrastructure and analytical instrumentation. The two go hand in hand. You're going to need the physical resource as well as the human resource. I mean, St. Kitts, we have a shortcoming definitely in terms of pathology, performance of autopsies. We don't have a local forensic pathologist or even a local clinical pathologist. Also, we don't have a DNA lab facility, no forensic DNA analysis, and we'll need scientists and a facility to house that type of analysis. Locally, in St. Kitts and Nevis, the job opportunities would be with the police force or the Ministry of National Security. And similarly, in the region, you find that there are law enforcement bodies that are actively trying to recruit, train and retain expertise in several forensic science disciplines, mostly latent fingerprint examination and firearms examination as well. Um, but you have some cases where they have civilian scientists being hired by government bodies. You can find those labs in Jamaica and also Trinidad and Tobago. So the American Academy of Forensic Sciences, that's the largest professional body of forensic scientists in the world, they have a subcommittee called FEPAC, the Forensic Science Educational Program Accreditation Committee. And FEPAC have come together for the forensic science community and decided what university programs need to offer for future forensic scientists. So you would definitely be able to check out FEPAC accredited programs at the bachelor's level, also at the master's level. And typically, if you're not going to go for a FEPAC accredited bachelor's program, what you can do is do a degree at any accredited university in natural science, chemistry, biology, physics, computer science, if you're interested in digital forensics, and at the master's level, if you want to go the non-forensic science route specifically, you should try and do something more tailored, more like a master's degree in genetics, a master's degree in analytical chemistry, you know, things like that. Considering schools in the UK, a Shevening scholarship can help. Here are some universities where you can pursue a master's degree in forensic science. This production was made by the St. Kitts and Nevis Shevening Alumni Association, complements of the Shevening Alumni Program Fund. Special thanks to the Foreign and Commonwealth Office of the United Kingdom Government and the British High Commission of Barbados and the Eastern Caribbean. For more information on Shevening Scholarships or the Association, check our Facebook page or the Shevening website.